In this video, we'll review the installation procedure for the 30MT incremental encoder module. Shown here is the mounting hardware. The mounting adapter plate, designed with a variety of bolt patterns common to servo motors. The 30MT encoder module. The overshaft magnet holder and the magnet. The threaded adapter plate and the mounting screws. A 1.5 mm hex wrench is needed for installation. First, the adapter plate is fastened onto the motor using the pre-drilled holes to center the encoder over the shaft. Next, screw the threaded encoder housing into the threaded adapter plate. Slide the magnet holder onto the shaft letting it bottom out and leaving it loose at this point. Place the threaded adapter plate with the encoder on the motor adapter, leaving the screws slightly loose. Next, we'll use the self-centering and threaded features of the encoder module to center the encoder and set the appropriate air gap. To illustrate how the self-centering alignment feature works, there's an internal taper on the bottom of the encoder module housing that fits with the taper on the magnet holder, allowing it to self-align when pressed together. To begin, push down on the encoder module while lifting up with the hex wrench, ensuring the tapers on the magnet holder and encoder fit together. Tighten the set screw on the magnet holder until there's no play. Then tighten the screws on the threaded adapter plate. An air gap of between 10 and 100 thousandths of an inch is needed between the top of the magnet holder and the surface of the module. To set the appropriate air gap between the module and the magnet, turn the module counterclockwise a half turn and then tighten the clamp on the threaded adapter plate. The encoder is now installed and ready for use. For more information about the Model 30MT and our other products, visit us online at encoder.com.